Hi, today I'll be taking you through the process of creating a transaction in the PayCargo system. First, log into your account with your username and password. Once you log in, you'll be brought to the dashboard, where you can easily create a new transaction by clicking on the orange button towards the top of the page. Alternatively, you can also click on the transactions link in the navigation menu which will bring you to the transactions page. Here you'll see the same orange button to create a new transaction, so let's click it. As you see, the new transaction window pops up. The first thing you'll want to do is choose the correct vendor to pay. Once you've chosen the vendor, the associated fields will populate below. Please fill in data for each of the fields marked by a red asterisk. Some fields will have helpful information pop up to the right when selected. If an incorrect number of value was entered, the field will be highlighted in red until the correct information is entered. Please make sure the dollar amount you enter matches the amount provided to you by the vendor. To schedule a payment for a later date, simply change the payment date here. To the right, you will be able to add transaction items if permitted by the vendor. If you are using PayCargo credit to pay for this transaction, you must specify the commercial invoice value of goods here and upload a commercial invoice here. Just below, you will find an area to add any additional file attachments to be viewed by the vendor. Please note the file size limit and the acceptable file types. Once you are all done, click Save to keep this transaction in created status, or if your administrator has given you the permission, you can save and approve this transaction to make the payment immediately. For now, we'll just save. A confirmation pop-up will appear in the top right corner, which will show the transaction you have just created, along with similar vendors that you can also pay through PayCargo. You'll see the transaction you just created at the top of the table. Click on it to view the transaction details. As you can see, the transaction has a status of created, which gives you the options to proof the transaction, if your company has this as an option, approve the transaction to make the payment now, or dispute or void the transaction if necessary. Once you hit approve, or proof and approve in this case, the pay transaction window will appear. Please make sure the vendor and total amount are correct before making the payment. If you have pay cargo credit, you will see this as a payment option. Otherwise, you will only be able to pay via overnight debit or via your prepaid funds depending on your account type. Once you click Make Payment, you will get a confirmation and have the option to print the transaction details for your records. Remember, if your vendor is a same-day release vendor, then they will immediately receive an alert of the approved transaction which will be used for cargo release. This concludes our tutorial of how to create a transaction. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to contact the PayCargo support team at support at paycargo.com or call us at 888-250-7778. Thank you and have a great day.